Hey there, welcome to the Morning Shred brought to you by the all new snowboards.com. I'm Jenna. I've got Steve from Forum here. We're going to talk about the Forum Cult Boot. Steve, have you ever been part of a cult? I have, but um, it's taken me a long time to get out of that cult and get back I'm to sorry. a normal lifestyle. Well, then let's but, talk about the boot then. Yeah, it's, I don't, I'm sorry. It's, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. okay. I'm trying to be more open about that, but uh, yeah, we probably should focus on the boot. Okay. And not my past life. Yeah. Actually, I might need a minute here. No, okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay. Uh, the cult, yeah, the cult boot. Hang on. Cult boot. This is going to be a great boot that's going to be good for anybody who's just getting into the sport. Up to um, yeah, kind of your intermediate park rider as well, too. It's soft, it's flexible, it's comfortable, not overly rigid and stiff, um, which um, you don't really want to put somebody who's just getting into the sport on something that's like too stiff whatsoever. Um, new boot for us for this year. And it's going to be our least expensive boot that features uh, speed zone technology as well, too. Okay, so let's jump right to the lacing. Uh, lacing, uh, speed zone. So this is something that we've been doing now for several years. And it is definitely the quickest and easiest way to get in and out of your boots. Basically what it is, is just a one pull system. Pull straight up, throw it back at you to lock it down. And it's just like that. And it's pretty cool, too, because it's zonal as well. So you got your lower zone, so your left lace is going to basically tighten up um, your ankle and below and then you got your high speed which is going to be your right side you pull up on that and that's going to tighten up the top so um, like myself if I like to <clears throat> I personally like to have it a lot tighter on the bottom a little bit looser up top so you kind of have that adjustability so super quick super easy pretty awesome great and um, I noticed the velcro on it it's a little unique too right yeah yeah that's going to definitely be unique to this boot it's going to be something that's definitely going to stand out so aesthetically it's just um, much more different than any other boot and it also um, offer, uh, offers a little bit of protection too for lace breakage as well too. So it does have some functional aspects also. Great, and uh, let's jump to the outsole of the boot. Um, yep, this is what we call our light sole. So um, super light, this is that's definitely gonna be one of the first things that you notice about this boot as well too, is just the weight of the boot, super light. And part of that's attributed to the light sole, which is basically a dual density outsole. It's gonna have some softer sections. That's gonna give you all your cushioning, all your dampening and it's also gonna give the boot its flexibility too. So not only is it comfortable within the binding, it's gonna be super comfortable cruising around, hiking, all that as well too. So it's got softer sections on, on the outsole and then it's got some harder um, sections as well too that's gonna give you all your traction so when you're hiking up some of those icy conditions also. All right, and then how about the liner? Uh, the liner, that's what we call our integrated liner. Um, just a super comfortable, sturdy, supportive liner that's uh, also heat moldable, so it's gonna custom form fit to your foot as well too. And it's got an internal lacing system. Also pull on that, it's gonna keep you snug all day. Great, well, uh, thanks for being here. I think you ingrained yourself back into civilization very well. Glad you. you were able to recover. Um, that's the uh, Form Cult boot, great boot for that beginner to intermediate level rider looking for a soft boot that has a lot of convenience features and um, something they can get in and out of and really kind of customize to their liking um, in terms of tightening the boot as well. Yeah, exactly. So check it out on snowboards.com and thanks for watching The Morning Shred.